Album three, we did the sleeve with uh, Storm again at Hypnosis, and uh, he introduced me to these things called Charisma Graphs, I think, but there was a photographer called Les Crims who discovered that if you take a Polaroid and you squash it, you can get the colors to run. And we used to go after them with different objects and burnt matches and coins and fingers and all sorts of things. And it was a, it was a lot of fun because you had to get the timing right, but you got some wonderful effects out of the distortions. <laughs> The third one was the first time I had a chance to work with Kate Bush, um, and we were singing on Games Without Frontiers. At her Weathering Heights that I really liked. I thought she had an extraordinary, wonderful voice and was doing great things um, as a writer. And um, you know, obviously went on to work with her again in the future on Don't Give Up. With Biko, uh, which became a very important song for me, uh, I had not written an overtly political song before. Later on, you know, I think it led me towards uh, some of the human rights stuff, which I'm still very much involved with today. So it was as much uh, a thing that helped shape me as the other way around.